Yo, what's good? I'm Rob Mayotte. That's D. Rich. And this is the Real Talk Sports Show. We're in the middle of an action-packed weekend. Last night, we witnessed St. V destroy Garfield 63 to nothing. Today, we're at the Hall of Fame at Fawcett Stadium to watch Bookdo versus Kent McKinley. D. Rich, let's get right to it, man. Let's break down the game. Well, for Bookdo, the key is they have to play fast. And that's something they know how to do very well. And they have to stick to that. For Kent McKinley, they're going to have the ball in their do-it-all man's hands. And that's Eric Glover Williams. And I'll talk about him a little bit later. But tonight, these teams are evenly matched. And the best athletes on the field will win the game. The best athletes tonight. Yes, we know two teams coming in with a lot of history in this state of Ohio. Cam McKinley with three state championships since the tournaments began and numerous pole championships before the tournament. Bookto, as we know, has two back-to-back -back state titles led by uh, current head coach Ricky Powers. We're going to see if these teams can light it up tonight. Mm -hmm. So uh, they mentioned that Bookto has a really tough schedule this year, though. Well, let me, let me comment on that. I think that this year's book to schedule is kind of light and I say that because I think Kent McKinley is a real real winnable game these teams match up very well size wise and athletic wise I think they match up very well Cardinal Mooney's not the old Cardinal Mooney that they used to be back in 2008 and 2009 and 2010 they're not the same anymore and uh, I think it's pretty light compared to previous years yeah. so key players for tonight who, who, who's going who's going to shine well for Kent McKinley you know like I said before Eric Glover Williams I don't know where he's going to line up tonight. He might line up at running back. He might line up at wide receiver. He might line up at quarterback. Shoot, he might line up at offensive tackle. We don't know where he's going to line up, Vert. But he's going to make an impact on tonight's game. And Bukto has to stop him. If they stop him, they win the game. For Bukto, Marquis Sams. You know what I'm saying? He's a real good athlete. Coach Power said he might be the best running back in the state by his senior year. But what I want to see tonight is if Bukto feeds him the ball. If you say he's going to be the best running back in the state his senior year, let me see you give him the ball 20 times and see what he does with it. You know what I'm saying? Put the ball, put, put the team on his back. Let me see what he does. Those are the key players for me tonight. Clever right. Williams, as we know, we seen him last year in the playoffs, man. Exciting, very exciting athlete. And Marquis Sands, we've seen him a couple times in some scrimmages, man. The kid looks like he got some really talent. We're going to see if he can live up to all the hype. Yes, sir. Uh, so, we reach to the part of the show where we give our predictions. Who you rolling with, D-Rich? Let me say something, man. I'm taking Bukto tonight. I know a lot of people take it as a shock. A lot of people that I talk to, a lot of people that I told. But I'm taking Bukto tonight. But whoever wins this game is going to be, I'm going to say, 24 to 12. Whoever wins this game is going to buy, be by two touchdowns, close in the fourth quarter, and somebody's going to take a 12-point lead in the fourth quarter. That's what I'm taking. I'm taking Bukto, though. I agree. I, I think it's going to be a hard-fought match. And uh, I'm going with Bukto by six in a defensive match. I'm going, I'm going to say 14 to eight. 14 to eight? Yeah. We're going to see, man. We're in, we in for a good one tonight. All right. We got the coverage for y'all. Y'all make sure y'all tune in and check me and D-Rich out on Twitter and YouTube. YouTube is at www.youtube slash users slash real sports. You can get all the highlights of the game and some more coverage and interviews from some of the players. Once again, it's Rob Mayotte, D-Rich, and this is the Real Talk Sports Show. State football champions on the gridiron trying to earn a seventh trip to the title game since 77. Fourth state championship in school history.
Eric Glover Williams, his first carry. Eric Glover Williams, spinning his way inside the 40 yard line. Eric Glover Williams gets the first call. Really kill <laughs> 34, Jared Smith. <laughs> Eric Glover Williams. Open field tackle number two. <laughs> Eric Glover Williams. Football, the cornerback Christopher Davis. Under pressure, Christopher Davis is back. Number 34, Jared Smith. And I'm, and I'm, Jared Smith, the ball carrier. Jared Smith. Tim. Kick is blocked by number 13, Tyman Olison. Quarterback keeper number eight, Christopher Davis. Garrett Smith. That was the loss from the 55, senior Anthony. Eric Weber Williams on the sweep. Robert Williams with the football. Jared Smith with the football. Jared Smith turns the corner, run out of bounds at the 35. Jared Smith, number 34. Smothers touchdown Bulldogs. The long snapper is Andrew Rio out of the hold of Chris Crowell White. Extra point good by Austin Shaheen. An interception return to the house by 
From his own 24, Eric Glover Williams met head on by number two, Hendrick Johnson. Eric Glover Williams. Support our athletes. We want to recognize and thank the men and women of Ambulance Associates for their continued support. And also thanks to the men. And dollars easy. The ball, Chris Crow White. Eric Glover Williams. Off a block by the wide receiver in a before chance. Eric Glover Williams, touchdown, Cortez Nelson. An extra point. We go to the middle quarter number three. Bulldogs lead it 28 to nothing. Go, Jack. Number four with the football team. Body left, Eric Glover Williams dragged down from behind. Number five. Ooh! Eric Smith bangs his way. Touchdown, Bulldog. 